Hey guys, so legs day. Um, I did something different this weekend. So instead of doing my usual squats, I decided to do something different. I decided to do some lunges, outdoor lunges, uh, with the barbell on my back. You know, we don't have like outdoor gyms in London. Every now and then, if we can take the gym outside, we do. Now, normally we do this in the summer. And it's warm, the sun's out, it's easy to breathe, the air is fresh. Yesterday was cold, yesterday was about 4 degrees Celsius, which is about 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Yesterday was tough. The set that you're about to see was the third set after two sets. Of, the first set was without any weight, the second set was with just a barbell. like it's flat, it's not. It's actually a slight gradient. So um, it's quite difficult. I mean, lunging up that gradient, you would think would be the hardest part, but it's not. It's coming back down. Burns, 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 burns. The distance that we cover, I would say, is probably about 25 meters. But it's there and back. And like I said, you're back up a gradient and then coming back down. So it's quite tough. I normally do this in the summer. So it's warm. The air feels a lot fresher today. It's cold, the air feels thin, my nose is quite blocked, so I'm struggling with it today. But I'm, you know, still getting on with it. We'll see how it goes. Now, this set with the 60 kilos is the tough one. This is like the fourth set. At this stage, my heart is beating fast. It's just harder and harder and harder. Literally, I stop. Every time you stop, you think that that's gonna help to get your breath back, but it's even worse, because your heart's just pounding.
mean, this is something I do every now and then. Just add some variation to the, to the workout and it's good to switch things up, do things a little different, shock your system. I enjoy the challenge of the lunges because it is very challenging. Every step you feel it, your heart you feel it. It's a good cardio aspect exercise as well because your heart is just beating, beating, beating. But I think it's a great addition to a legs day. Some of you might ask, why not do this in the gym? We do actually do the walking lunges in the gym at more distance outside. That's, that's, that's the sole reason we go outside because of the distance we can cover. We go a lot further and we can use the barbell. We couldn't necessarily use the barbell in the gym because it's a small gym, you're going to take someone's head off from the bar. So we get that gradient because that gradient is a challenge, it's a big challenge. It, it, it really does change the game, that, that, that gradient of going uphill and then coming back down. Really feel each step as you're coming down. With walking lunges, it's something I do mostly at the end of the workout. If we do it outside, we do it before because of the task of taking out the, the, the equipment. You know, it's, it's, it's a big deal doing it outside. Our gym's on like a second floor, so we have to literally take the barbell all the way downstairs to do it. If I'm doing walking lunges in the gym, it's at the end of the workout, and we do laps, laps and laps and laps, back and forth, back and forth. And I really get into a when I'm, when, I'm, when I'm doing those lunges. And like I said, it's, it, it does go into a form of cardio, because every time you get to the other side, your heart's racing. I mean, you're feeling the burn, but your heart's racing. And then um, it's just, you know, keeping that pace, keeping that pace. We like to do it in a train as well. So we'll have a train of people doing it, uh, let's say four people, and you follow that train, you get to the other side. As soon as the, other, the last person comes, the first person that arrives goes back in, straight to the other side. Let's go, let's keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. It's actually something you can do with your gym partners that is quite enjoyable. Especially because when you get to the other side um, and your partner is panting, waiting, you literally have to say, you need to go, I need to go, so you need to go. So, and, and it's, 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 it's a really good, fun way of killing your legs at the end of a workout. I say fun, it's very painful, it's very, um, very tiring. Um, you may collapse a few times halfway through if you do as many laps as we do, for sure. But um, it's very enjoyable, it's something that I think is great to finish a leg workout, give you a nice pump on your quads. It's great for glutes. There's this big, you know, fascination with girls squatting for their glutes. Squats are perfect for glutes. With weight, perfect. Lunging is perfect for glutes as well. So for the ladies out there, as much as you're doing your squats, you wanna hit those lunges as well, because they're just as effective. So um, maybe add this to your, to your legs workout. Lunge around the gym, find some space, and um, lunge, walking lunge, it's amazing. It's a, it's a great way of killing the glutes, killing the thighs, and um, burning those points.